this is this is really one of the key um, sizes you want to get on grain sorghum from a weed control perspective because until it gets to this size it really doesn't have its feet under it very well and as a result we can get we can get injury with a lot of common herbicides uh, that you wouldn't see in corn things like atrazine uh, even dicamba uh, if it really needs to get up to about three leaves um, before we can spray it and and not hurt the grain sorghum and still get some decent weed control. So a lot of folks go out with like two pounds of atrazine and a quart of crop oil trying to take out grass that, that may have, have uh, escaped the pre. Uh, this is about the time when you want to consider spraying it and not before uh, for safety of the grain sorghum. We're really getting some challenges right now because these pre's haven't been activated. We've been very dry for the last two weeks. Uh, so things like grasses and pigweed species, particularly here Palmer amaranth, are really starting to, to get getting going and in, into rolling. So we got to keep monitoring for those as we go forward. Um, and then we can go out with things like atrazine uh, up to about 12 inches tall on the grain sorghum, 2,4-D, dicamba. Again, you can't use rates of those herbicides you could in corn. That's about half the rate you use in corn. Uh, and then one of the newer herbicides, Husky, uh, to try and, try and take out those pigweeds if they come up later.